identity. I'm paying to confirm your date of birth for me, please. The contact tracing? Is this contact tracing or? Yes, it is. Okay, yeah. Um, whenever somebody tests positive or going today because you did test positive for COVID, that means you have the virus that causes COVID-19. Sometimes part of the city by an issue called the test and trace part, which is like you mentioned, contact tracing. Yeah. And it's aiming to stop COVID-19 infections in New York. So during this call, I'll ask you questions about your health and the people you have come in close contact with, and I'll provide you with information on how to access some of the services you may need. Okay. The information should be kept confidential to the fullest extent of the law, so consciousness or she difficulty waking up, confusion, inability to talk about catching your breath, catching and in case of emergency, um, who should we call? Um, a slight headache. Okay, any vomiting on all the No. Any loss of smell or taste? Loss of smell. Okay, any, um, any sinus congestion? Yes. Um, any confusion? No. Mm -hmm. And can you recall, like, a, around what date you started feeling these symptoms? Um, so now I just have some questions about the people with whom you had close contact with that have had. We're talking about any, it's to find out anybody who were within six feet. For a total of 10 minutes or more. Mm -hmm. Okay? Live with anyone in your home, just like family members, roommates, housemates? I live with my boyfriend. She gave me COVID. <laughs> and it's at the same place that you live. Are you guys gonna call me? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hi. <laughs> just might as well. You're already for real with us in this place. <laughs> No. If I had the wrong number or somebody you guys are staying six feet away from each other, if you cannot stay six feet away, make sure you're wearing a mask. Um, avoid sharing any household items. Um, you're staying away from caffeine and alcohol and getting as much rest um, as possible. Oh, thank you so much. Good morning. I just got off of the phone with someone from Contact Tracing here in New York. And that was crazy because obviously like right now I've been getting so many telemarketer phone calls and so like I never answer my phone but this was a New York area code so I answered it obviously and so it was someone from contact tracing and the way she answered the phone she was just like hi I'm calling from New York hospital something are you Mariah and I'm like yeah and she was like I have news about your health like I need your birthday and your address and I was like freaking out because like she didn't tell me that she was from contact tracing I asked her I was like is this contact tracing and she was like yeah and I was like oh well like you should have said so that was like the first five minutes of the conversation and then um, she just asked like where um, I've been the last few days or whatever if I've been in contact with anyone yeah and then she asked if um, if I live with anyone, so obviously I told her that I live with my boyfriend and um, that he's sick now, so they're probably gonna end up calling him. Um, but yeah, and then they asked if I wanted to stay in a hotel, which is weird because like, if I needed to stay in a hotel, the reason would be so that I could not be near whoever I was living with. But it's way too late for him now. Like they called too late, I guess is what I'm saying. So I don't know. Anyways, um, just gave her that information and then she asked about my symptoms and um, and then she said that they were going to call or text, uh, depending on which one I wanted, um, for the following days to just like check up on me or whatever. So we'll see what that's like tomorrow. Um, and then we'll see if they call power. So that was that. Um, I'm probably going to go take a shower now, wash my hair with that new... Um, Amika stuff I cannot wait because my hair is like super dry right now and then maybe do you, are you in the mood for me to make Paula not in the mood for me to make you're not in the mood so should I save the latkes we shouldn't do it today I'm not sure I guess we'll wait and see if we're gonna make that today I don't know what else I'm bored um, editing yesterday's video and gonna get that up my symptoms today are the same as yesterday I've been like steady for the past like three days um, I'm not it's like weird because I'm not 
stuffed anymore really my nose isn't like stuffy but it is like I don't know how to explain it like I feel the pressure and like it is kind of stuffy other than that I don't really have other symptoms I'm, I've been doing this like okay so I've been researching and apparently you can like you have to do a smell test to like uh, strengthen your smell senses to like get it back so basically you're supposed to have four different essential oils and you're supposed to smell them for like 20 seconds each twice a day and like mentally like imagine what those smells are so i have lavender eucalyptus this uh i don't know what this is actually this is like a housewarming smell but it has like it has a strong smell usually i can't smell it now i have like four different lavender essential oils but so um, I guess I'll just smell something else. I've just been smelling these three. So pretty much I just sit here and I just like smell it. And I'm happy to announce that I can kind of differentiate them. This is the eucalyptus though and like I just like can tell that it's like minty because it tingles my nose. But other than that, um, I can't really tell which one's which so I'm gonna be doing this for like every day because I really want that to come back because it's really annoying thank god thank god honestly that I still have my taste because food is life so I'm gonna go shower maybe I'll put the eucalyptus in the diffuser in the shower so it could be like a steamy shower lunch today is some leftover pizza from last night and then I'm gonna put some of this Follow your heart, vegan ranch, and red pepper flakes, obviously. I just blow dried my hair for the first time in a long time. <laughs> um, and it feels nice to have nice and clean hair. But something is going on outside. I think there's protests going on. Yeah, like three people get struck by a car. Three people? Yeah, 39th and 3rd. Was it a police car? I have no idea. <gasps> oh, wait, that's like... Oh my god. You took the even better ones. I took his socks. I want those. You want them off my feet? No, there's another pair though. No, I'm jealous. Those are like, why do you always take my good shit? You know what? I brought them to you, so don't complain. You're lucky I brought you those. Anyways, there's helicopters. If I can open this door. Ow, it's cold. There's a bunch of, oh shoot. Something's going on. I'm so nosy. Wow, yeah, something's going on. This whole, st oh shit. The whole street is blocked off and there's cops everywhere. Holy moly. I gotta go inside, it's cold. Okay, it's freezing out there. Um, but there's like, there's it. Look, you have to go out there. You have to look. There's the whole street is blocked off. There's a million police cars over there. Yeah, no, I was just watching. Oh, feels nice out there though. I will say. I get chills for no reason. Right? <sighs> I think I'm gonna step outside. Let's see your fever. Let's see what it was just at. Last it was at a hundred. Oh, yeah. oh 99.5. It's going down. Probably because you need to take that for moment. You're so moody today. I am. I'm not like that. Oh. I get chills and I get a headache. I'm sorry. Can I help you? Well, that depends. What type of uh, what's are we talking about? Talking about the Hilton? Talking about the W? Talking about the Four Seasons? <laughs> oh 
my god look how cute she is just laying on me like this using me as a pillow wow so cute this is the only lighter we have right now and both of us the noise is like killing us all right what's it gonna be tonight can i go first no yeah. i'm gonna go with this one good choice yeah i just feel it today I guess I'm gonna go with this one. The first one? No. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We'll see. All right. So we're making baked potatoes and potatoes. I I am queen of potatoes. Like Mariah's the queen I of potato. The potato queen, Insert so. <laughs> crown. Potato crown. So let me just share how you're supposed to make potatoes. Okay. So first of all, you bake the potatoes. You bake the potatoes in the oven for a really long time till they're crispy on the outside. Crispy. Then you mat you take the insides and you scoop it out into said bowl okay then you have these mash right here then we're going to take vegan butter this is miyoko's we're going to put it in the bowl with a little bit of salt and we're going to mash this up okay why do i always uh, in my mind i know it's miyoko's but i always say mykonos yeah you're not alone a lot of people do it she's actually the cutest woman ever i've seen her in a bunch of videos she's like the cutest woman ever and i just want to be friends with her because her butter is like the best and so I'm gonna have this and then I made some spinach these like little spinach nugget things veggie burger things sauteed kale and then you're gonna have a little bit of pizza yeah okay. because that pizza was fucking massive it was like what's it called I had uh, I had an entire I have an entire thing I only ate like a quarter of it yeah so like that I had was a massive pizza no, I finished nice. mine. Okay, I'm just microwaving this for a little bit because just to heat up the butter. Because um, the potato was cooked a little bit ago, like 30 minutes ago. So I just want it to be hot. <sighs> it's not fun to be us right now, kids. I just like my neck hurts. Everything hurts for me. I've had like the worst absolute worst headaches for the past three days they're like unbearable yeah you've had bad headaches and this morning i woke up with like a slight fever as well it's like the weirdest thing in the world it really is it is strange i also get chills all day for no reason yeah. po possible I'm, I'm like it's pretty hot wrapped up in a blanket I, I just get chills down my spine. It's pretty hot in the apartment, too. Yeah, it's warm in here. I think I need to microwave a little bit longer. Oh no, it's coming. <laughs> the stuffs. The stuffiness. Let's play a game. Out of every picture on here, on the fridge, where would you want to be the most out of every single picture on this fridge? Like, if you could blink into a moment, where would it be? Where would it be? That's a good question. So, like, I mean, this day was pretty epic. Oh, we met Kaigo. That was epic! And then, like, this, pic this was fun, too. Kaigo concert. You have to pick one though. But like, look at me in my bucket hat. <laughs> That's my favorite picture ever. But this puppy though. Um, okay. Tough to say. Like in this moment, like it doesn't have to be like your favorite memory, but like if you could just blink somewhere right now and be there, what would it be? I think this was fun because all of my friends were here. Kygo concert? Yeah. At Barclays? At Barclays. Good one. That's so a really fun. good one. That was a good hour. Okay. Let's see. This is tough. Let me put my picture Wait, this down. was Copenhagen. No, that was Poland. Oh. I was just looking at that. Oh my god. Okay, I was nauseous here. <laughs> so that's not it. I was like seasick. Okay, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna have to say. Honestly, I'm gonna do this. Wait. Yeah, if I could be anywhere right now, it would be this day. Because this is when we had 
um, we were at the beach in Tulum and like my whole family was there and it was just such a good day. And here we are now making potatoes. <laughs> potatoes are fun. Potatoes are fun. It's full of joy right there. Yeah. Okay, so there's just butter in here. And here's our gorgeous dinner. <laughs> Random, but this kale is actually really good. It's just garlic, olive oil, kale, sauteed. I added some chives to the potato. And then these are these little spinach nugget things. Well, well, well. Look who won two nights in a row. Good night, everyone. It's not a good day. It's not a good day. Hopefully tomorrow will be a better one. Yeah. Please yeah. like and subscribe. Please. You've seen us <laughs> suffer. <laughs>